All right, guys, Georgia Jim, got a Dorma 3003 here. This is a seven pin lock. See how the lock works. All right, Let's see if we can get this thing picked. I'm gonna go uh, 40 thousandths top of the keyway with a uh, number four hook and 25 thousandths. I'm right, gonna click on five or maybe a six. Uh, big click on six. Wait, no, that was seven. Seven, six again. Five, four, three. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Six again. Three, two. Seven. Just looking for small little clicks on everything. Because this lock has tapered and kind of like the GG spools. So you catch yourself running back and forth tapping tapers and then when you move these spools up or serrated spools whatever you call them when you get them up the uh, uh, the tapers drop a little bit Click on two, three. Felt this tiny little bit of core movement. Six. Trying to get seven up. Trying to balance that tension. Seven, six, five, four, two. Seven again. Six, five, three. Seven, there we go. All right, let's get this gutted. For a second, yeah, we'll just use this little mini tray. All right, We'll lock it back up. One, two, three, four, five, seven, six, and there's a uh, nothing on the core, no counter milling or anything like that. If they had tossed that in, that would have uh, made this a lot harder. 
We do have torpedo key pins on one, two, four, and five. show you guys what I'm talking about when I say a serrated spool or whatever it is. Let's see if we can get that to focus. Yeah, like kind of like a little GG style drivers. Got another one on two. I tapered on three. long serrated on five and four and five tapered on six tapered on seven I'm not gonna bother dumping the springs we all know what those look like and I'll get these and let's do it like this there we go and uh, here we go, guys. That's the uh, Dorma 3003. All right, thanks for watching.